Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. Today, as you can see by the title, we're getting the tattoos that I was talking about fucking ages ago. I think I mentioned it maybe like a month ago when I booked it that I was getting two tattoos. So I've actually decided in the last like mere 12 hours that the one that I was going to get on the side of my hip, I might get on my arm because I like it the best and I want people to see it. I know that I want people to see it, but like I want to be able to see it. And I'm not going to really be able to see if it's on my hip. So I can tell you now what I'm getting because like what you're going to see in like five probably about two months anyway so I'm getting the word trust there on my arm and I'm getting the wee red lightning bolt but I'm gonna get it there and I I was gonna get it at the side of my hip and start photos of what I was gonna get but now I think I'm gonna get it inside my arm I need to go because it's I literally somebody's walked by my car should I even wave um, yeah it's literally 10 past 11 and my appointment's at 12 and it's in Hollywood it's 45 minutes and I want a daily coffee before but more to the point I need to turn on my, a my AC because it's 27 degrees in my car oh my god guys I'm fucking sweating so I you know I can't like vlog and drive I might try a bit if it like stabilizes but if it doesn't I'll just speak to you when I get there Okay guys, so I finally arrived at my destination and I'm just waiting outside because I don't want to go in early because I don't actually know what time they open up. Um, but it's like eight minutes to my appointment and I still can't decide whether I want to get the fucking lightning bolt on my wrist or on my side. Please, who doesn't know this shit? It's going to be on my body for the rest of my life. Although honestly I thought my life would have been cut short because on the way here I smelt burning and I thought oh fuck my car bonnet like underneath it's burning and I'm by myself and I've never ever even thought about what that would mean for me like I I didn't know what that meant and I didn't know what I was meant to do I was in the motorway and I was like oh my god I'm done like I don't know if it looks like I've probably got a highlight on I was profusely sweating at this scenario because I was like I have no idea how to save my life right now slightly concerning but we're here and I'm just not open, gonna open up the car bonnet so here's hoping it doesn't blow up and if it does blow up guys I actually really enjoy my life and I'm really happy right now, like at this moment I'm really happy, so it was a good way to end. I, my phone's gonna die, so I don't even know if I can video anything when I'm in there, plus I feel like we got too caught off the video. Um, but I, if it's like, the vibe's right, like if his vibe is like open and honest, not open and honest, but open-minded, I will be like, hey, can I like video some things? But if it's not, then you're just gonna see me back in the car and I'll just have fucking two tattoos, do you know what I mean? By the way, I'm gonna crooked my tattoo in Hollywood, I don't even know if I said that, and the boy that's doing my tattoo is called like Lucas somebody. He's like a single needle tattoo artist because I want a really small wee skinny single needle vibe, you know. But I think I'm going to go in now because it's in six minutes. I need to go. I wanted to get a coffee before but of course I didn't leave it enough time so I'm going to get a coffee after. I was going to go to the beach but now I'm like I might just go home and sunbathe because um, my phone's going to die and I'm just going to be sitting at the beach talking to myself which is, you know, not a vibe. Um, okay, let's go. <laughs> There's a boy right there, but we're, we're doing this anyway because I'm too excited to show Ian's, Ian's this one. I'm fucking obsessed with this. You just need to see how this like falls when I like it. It's like there, so you can't even see it. And then when you turn to the back, like when I'm standing, how it falls, it looks so good. He done such a good job with that one. And then here, I love this one. Oh my god, they're just so like like you don't even see them like when I'm standing dead on. Like you have to, I have to be like standing in a certain way for you to see them. I'm fucking obsessed. They're so like fine. I love this one. They're so fine and cute. Oh my god, I love it. Anyway, I'm gonna walk and get a coffee now because I still have like 20 minutes on this. Um, my phone's gonna die. My phone's gonna die. So I don't, didn't really vlog in there, but he is so nice. Um, his name's like Lucas. Um, I can't remember what his last name is. He's so cool, he's so nice. So good at his job. He's moving to Dublin though in August, but you can still go down to Dublin and go to him if like you're into like single needle tattoos, because I've always wanted tattoos, but I didn't want a thick one, so, so happy with this. Let's go get a nice latte. So I just got home there. Here you can see it a bit better. There. And there, can you see it? Time to go get Aoife's reaction. Let's see what she thinks. Reaction time. Don't get me on this. Boy. Oh, she's not all in it, guys. What do you think? You need to properly look at it to see what it says. Right, but that's what the boy said. Like, we were trying to pick a font, and he was like, I think this one's cool because you can't really tell what it says. You need to pure look at it. Lovely. Let me see the other one. Cool. Do you like them? Love them. Do you actually love them? Mm -hmm. Are they pure, like, cute the way they're, like, so thin? Yeah. I wanted it smaller, but that was the smallest one he was had ripped sword? down. 
it was like it pure vibrated your arm so it made like your whole arm vibrate so like when he's doing this one i just felt like, zzz, like all up but my it wasn't arm painful. no it's sore it's like nippy but it's like everyone says oh it feels like somebody's like ripping their skin at home but i would say that the more the pain comes from like the vibration that sends up your arm hard lead we burned that very good yep. how long did it take five minutes this one literally this we lightning bolt literally took i would say 30 seconds well, that's good then, maybe that's why you didn't think it was that sore. People get like... Because yeah, they're just wee thin, they're wee thin lines too. That one took a wee bit longer because it was like joined up. I can't believe you two tattoos. Why? <laughs> you don't seriously look at Good reaction. Oh, by the way, I didn't die in the way home. I thought I was going to, no joke. thought my car was going to blow up. I get everyone else's reaction later. Uh, it's really not that deep to be honest. Oh my god, I love the fucking lightning bolt. Look at it in the mirror. I don't think you can really see it. Lighting's so bad everywhere because it's like so sunny right so Yeah, the lighting's for shit in here as well. Right, so let me see if you can see it now. So like, you know, like just hangs. Like I think it's like in a really good place. Like it just hang. And you can just see it. Like it looks lit and then this one. You can kind of see this one a bit more to be honest. But you need to see it, you know. So there we go guys. Done and I already know I want about five more. I want to get one behind my ear. I want to get one on my finger. So I have come over here and I, um, it's literally 28 degrees. So I was going to literally just wear a sports bra, but I thought it'd be a bit too promiscuous for training, you know, all my mom and your boys. Just, he told me I have to keep my sticker things on, like the plaster thing for like two days. So I just want to put these big massive stickers on. They like plasters because I don't want them to fall off. And like, if people are tackling me and it's rubbing and stuff, like, I, I really don't want it to fade, so like, we're trying to do what we can, you know. I've also been lying in the sun all day, which is apparently not recommended. Don't really know why. But, guys, do you think I'm really not going to lie in the sun when it's 28 degrees? I said, like, have we met? I'm also not allowed to get it wet. Um, so I had to get a shower then, because I was also sweating from lying out all day. I had to get a shower with my hands in the air, and, like, I barely even fucking rubbed myself. But you know what, guys? We move. Time to go train, and it will update you as if my plaster fall off. Love that. Hey guys, so we're out for dinner. I'm here with Jack Hutchins. <laughs> and I'm just gonna give you some update today what happened was my plasters fell off um, and I've got them covered up because I'm so embarrassed if anyone's seen them. Okay guys, um, we're in Neptune Pond getting a cocktail. Um, no, we're not getting a cocktail, I'm driving. We're getting dinner and then we're going to the beach because Hutch is drinking White Claws. No, it's not White Claws, White Claws. What seltzer is me? What seltzer is that? So we'll show you our food because you know we didn't show you enough that? of the food that? in London apparently so. Where do you get the water? Hi guys, so we're just chilling for some post dinner um, chills. But she's having the wee Bud Light seltzer. I'm not because I'm driving. And it's actually really lovely down here. It's a wee bit misty, isn't it? Like that, like every time I had seen photos of people at the port, it was pure misty and weird, but it's only a wee tiny bit misty. And I actually do think it's going to be a really nice sunset. Um, so it was literally gorge, gorge, gorge. So full. Woody and ice cream though. Loopy. I'm not sure. I just tried to record that on my phone. I think it died. So I don't know if you actually seen, but it's actually really nice around here. It's a wee bit misty because every day I had seen people at the board, it had been like messy enough that you can't even see like this or the sky. But we can see the sky, guys, and I think we're gonna get a good sunset. I'm not allowed into the water because apparently this, no, no, apparently the chlorine strips your tattoo, so like the chlorine makes the ink run out of your tattoo, and then the seawater just can get it infected. But also, he told me to wash it with salt water, so like strip that as salt water in it. Maybe because people piss and shit in the ocean. I had like a really bad dream last night about. Did you sell that water in your foot? No, it's on my boob. It's actually on my knee if you wanna get into it. Yes, I had a dream about sharks. Um, like killing people. No, you never. Yes I did. Have a dream no, about sharks. Yes I did. You, told me you said you were gonna make this up. Oh very funny now, very funny now. <laughs> Well, I had a dream about sharks, and now I'm scared to go in the water ever again anyway, because everyone keeps jumping in. Anyway, I was going to go jump in the Helens by the Mara, which I get with me, but they're just actually driving on on me because I'm working, so won't be able to do that. And turn, turn around, Sharita. 
to get my tattoos uh, in the salt water. What are you laughing at? <laughs> You're laughing. I'm not supposed to get them in the salt water. Yeah, but fuck it. It's been two days, like chill out. Anyway, this is the absolute scenage, mate. Just after training, so I'm fucking sweating my tits off here. I'm about to get into this. Will I shit myself and probably get out? Mm, probably. It's not that I had anything else to vlog in relation to my tattoo, but I just kind of made the start of it about the tattoo and then I made the rest of it about just like my days in the sun. Anyway, little update. They look really good. You can't see anything, but they look really good. They're still holding strong. They're healed like pretty much really well. They didn't even really scab or anything. I think it's because they're too small. They didn't really scab. They didn't really fade. Um, all looking good. So I know this is kind of like a weird one, short one kind of more weird than short to be honest but hope you all enjoyed and see you in the next one